Defence ministers today clashed with Brexiteer MPs over warnings that joining part of the EU's permanent structured cooperation, PESCO, will drag Britain into a new EU army. Brexiteer MPs clashed with ministers today in the House of Commons as the government refused to rule out taking further steps towards joining a new EU army. The issue was raised by Reclaim MP Andrew Bridgen who was one of the Tory Brexiteer Spartans before he was expelled from the Conservatives. He questioned why the UK has agreed to sign up to part of the EU's permanent structured cooperation, PESCO, often termed by critics as the EU Army, on moving military across Europe. The North West Leicestershire MP said, So Richard Dearlove, former head of MI6 has given evidence to House committees on this issue and he questioned why we were joining this and who had all. He also stated that membership of these European Union defence structures is not an a la carte menu where the UK can choose what it wants and reject what it does not. He added, it is very much a take it or leave it, all or nothing, situation. Does the minister agree with Sir Richard's assessment? But Armed Forces Minister James Heapy suggested that Mr. Bru he said, the UK applied to join the Permanent Structured Cooperation Military Mobility Project to help shape EU military transport procedures and infrastructure, addressing impediments to moving military personnel and assets across Europe at pace. We are negotiating the technical terms of our participation in the form of an administrative arrangement and have reached an agreement on the majority of the text. He added, conspiracy is not as rife as